Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to episode number 8 of the Borussia Dortmund Corona series. In this episode, we're going to recap what's happened recently, and as you can see, we've been in absolutely shocking form. We've, since the game against Lazio, where we lost on their one out of the Europa League, we've just won two of them. <laughs> we started off with a 1 1 draw with Borussia Mönchengladbach, and Gladbach, and they get the goal there, which was very last minute and didn't go down very well I was getting quite annoyed in this set of fixtures we were then played by Leverkusen and got a 3-0 win in the league so in their sec they were second at the time it was a very good win for us we just dominated and just all flowed in that game we then played them in the German Cup quarter final a few days later and it went to extra time some penalties which we effectively didn't do very good at and we lost on, on them, unfortunately. Then we played um, Shackle and just got dominated. We did nothing. Just completely collapsed, really. Hatchery from Dennis Gonzalez, who did very well against us and just tore us to shreds. Our defence just didn't turn up in that game. We then played Una Berlin and drew 0-0. Nothing really happened. They we dominated, just couldn't break them down. Their goalkeeper was the man of the match, as far as I can tell. Oh well, no, Digna was the man of the match. Yet yeah, their goalkeeper was very good for them and probably deserved man of the match as well. So a bit of a shame. Then play Mainz and lost one 0 They got a goal quite early on and they sat back. We didn't really do a lot at all in that one either. We just I don't know lost all confidence recently. But we just played Hanover and beat them 4 0. So I've actually swapped the system up for this to go back to having Lukaku up top. And it worked. Um, well, I needed to sort of settle things down and sort of try and get some points on the board. Because at the minute, I believe we are sitting top of the league. And if we win, we've won the league. I think that's what I said in my. Um, no, that's in the 19s. Definitely something around here about um, confidence in that. Um, I'm probably not going to find it now. Um, can potential chance have a one more right result? Are you confident? Yeah, so if we win, we should win the league. So we're going to jump straight into this. We're going to stick with the four and um, back to the one up top system. We're going to take Roos out though and bring Brandt in. Because I don't want him to extend that injury anymore. Because I don't use him. Um, Leon suspended for getting a yellow card in the last game. So let's just pretty much go full strength as you'd expect pass that's playing up on the right with the injuries in that you sort of had to play that against is playing in the middle which isn't going to happen because Ilson can go in there that's an advance forward uh, let me see what other team was they got Planas, Bruma Drury got Gabriel Geiger, Jung, Holtby Lazaga and I'm not pronouncing his name so, not many players I recognise, but let's see if we can claim a victory. We're going to sort of hopefully carry on the form of the last game into this one. Because that sort of just went a bit downhill recently. And we could do a good end of the season. Sort of prepare us for next year. And where are we going to go with this? Um, we're away from home, so hopefully it's going to be a bit better. It's been frustrating the last couple of games, just not being able to do anything. We don't. We have good games, and then like something happens, and we just don't score, and they do. But Lukaku, since I pushed back to this striker in this game, he's <laughs> actually just been insane. So next season, I think I'll be changing up the system slightly. I think I'm going to want to stick with the strikeless option, but change around some of the roles and the way the formation lines up. But we'll see about that as we come to it. 
but let's just finish off where we are now and if we can win this game we've won the league and that's going to make it two years in a row we've beaten by now so domestically we're doing well it's just continentally we're doing shocking because we just don't seem to be able to get anywhere against um, any team we can get out of the group into the oh, we can't get out of the group actually we seem to um, fail and end up finishing third and just I get annoyed and frustrated with it <laughs> but hopefully next season we can um, improve and be able to uh, keep grow not growing keep improving domestically and sort of extend our lead other than the recent run of form we've done pretty much as expected and it's been really good for us but I really want to do well in Europe that's something we haven't done at all in this series and it's the one trophy I want to sort of put playing for next year and really go for it if I can get a system working um, a striker system working for next year that'd be even better and try and push on and have like this system as the backup because I don't know because I want to have a full gym team I don't know if Lukaku is going to stay depending on any offers come in okay he's my top goal scorer but in the terms of I want a full German team having him in there isn't going to help <laughs> and like Digne will move on this summer as Marek 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 will be able to play for us as he'll be old enough to now join in but we've got to concentrate on this game and Muller's got his we've got hope he's in the middle three Ooh, and he just pulls it past the post and he got away with that a little bit and too much space to cross yes I can realise that if he's getting the ball in Brent's got it this time where's he going to go puts it all the way out to pass slack so I'm playing two right backs on the right side of the field so you think defensively we'd be alright Gundogan's got it here wings it out to Brandt he gets it to Lukaku gets another goal and he's just been other than the injury which caused us to change the system up um, he's just been exceptional again this year is it 26 goals I think that said in this season but I've no, no idea how many games that's in so I'm going to look at that after the game because yeah it's 25 and value 23 million excuse me are we going to go for this there's a rock up to Groot, it's going to stop it, Digne lose out and he gets the goal back. Literally moments after Lukaku puts us in to a 2-0 lead, they pull it back to 2-1 and it's going to be an edgy last half an hour. Uh, tried to close him down, Digne doesn't do anything. Las Las Goa? Las Gog? Mm, I don't quite know. I was able to knock it in right at the end and Weissel's not having the best of games I might have a look at see if I can bring on push Mayo out to the right maybe and bring Illa into the middle yeah let's do that let's push Mayo out to the right drop past that back in defence take Weissel off for Illa and then what can we do as well he's not playing very well no one really, they're all playing alright other than that. Digne lost the challenge in the for their goal, but can't really do much about that. But we're dominating the game in terms of 17, 18 shots, 19 shots, so we're still going. We've got 
free kick on the edge of the box. It doesn't get there. Muller's got it. Can we stop him from breaking on us? Plays it through to Holtby. Who's number three? Digner. Good tracking back to get there. Brant's down the left. And that's it. I didn't realise it was there. But an excellent game there in terms of getting the result we needed and winning the league. Which I believe we're going to get confirmation of now. Jump all the way up here. Yes, fine. Is that not us who won the league? What to come up and say we won the league? So, um, two games left. Yeah. That's six points. Okay, so we need a point from the next two games to win the league. Yeah. That looks about right. So let's have a look. We've got 21 goals in the league. And so what's that? 20. Oh, didn't want that. Let's go to Chris. That's easy to sit there. He's got 21 and 25 in the league, 5 assists, 6 player of the matches, and 26 in 28 overall. So very good. And can't really complain about that. So let's come back for the Bayern Munich game actually. So thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next episode.